Hello everyone! Welcome to Olive Oil IELTS. I'm Olive, your friend to help you master IELTS. Today we'll be looking at IELTS writing task 1, and in particular, the introduction paragraph. And this is an example of what type of questions you may get in IELTS writing task 1. The bar chart below gives information about student applications at three U.S. universities over the period from 1990 to 2010 in four different faculty areas. Summarize the information by selecting and reporting the main features and make comparisons where relevant. So what you do to write the introduction paragraph for task 1 is to simply rewrite the question. Rewrite, yes, rewrite. 复述改写, rewrite the question. But how? Ha. First, you have to name the diagram. So, what is the diagram you get for the question? Is it a bar chart? Is it a line graph? Is it a table? Is it a pie chart? Or it's simply a diagram? So this is a bar chart. Bar chart. 柱状图. You see these little bars sticking out, the blue, red, and green? These are all the bars. Bar chart. And this is a line graph. 线形图. Line graph. And this is a table. 表格. Table. 表格. And this is a pie chart. 饼图. Pie chart. Last but not least, this is a process map. 流程图, process map. 流程图. These are all the diagrams you may get in writing task 1. And the second, the verbs. The pie chart shows, the pie chart illustrates, the pie chart indicates, the pie chart demonstrates, the pie chart gives information about. You have to remember at least two or three verbs. So you can substitute the verbs you get in the question. And the next step is to rewrite the rest of the question. How? You can use synonyms. Synonyms, yes. The rest of the sentence is Student applications at three US universities over the period from 1990 to 2010 in four different faculty areas. So uh, you can change the word U.S. universities to American universities and also over the period from 1990 to 2010 you can change it into between 1990 and 2010 or you can say over 20 years. Also you can rearrange the sentence order. So here you can re arrange the sentence order and make the sentence into something like this. Student applications in four different faculty areas at three US universities over the period from 1990 to 2010. So by rearranging the sentence order, you actually create a whole brand new sentence. Last but not least is the transition sentence. So you can say, here follows the analysis, here come the details, the more detailed analysis is below. So by combining all the techniques we've learned before, we can rewrite the question and make it into something like this. The bar chart, yes, the first part, name the diagram, shows this is the verb. Student applications in four different faculty areas at three American universities between 1990 and 2010. Here comes the details, the transition sentence. It's so easy to rewrite the introduction paragraph for writing task 1. So, practice! I hope you find today's video useful and um, leave a comment. Tell me what you think and I will make videos upon your requests. So you know what to do, subscribe me and I will see you in the next video. Bye!